Epic Morning is brought to you by Christie Sports Local Bike Shop with the Valley's newest full-service bike shop in Westville and rental bikes available in Vail Village. With hikes like these that kind of open up from the foliage, you just feel like you are on top of the world. Now, the terrain is a little bit rocky and it can get a little bit dense in certain areas, but you end up coming to spots that open up like this that just offer these incredible views. Check it out. Now, one of my favorite things about the Gore Creek Trail is that there's a lot of really nice trail highlights. The first four miles of the trail, it climbs along uh, Gore Creek, and then there are some short steep sections along the way as well, um, but for the most part, it's not that steep. So the trail winds through the meadows and these aspen groves, and they change um, to, uh, to as you're going up in elevation and above the tree line. So um, as elevation increases, you'll see kind of different foliage as you're making your way up in elevation and one of my favorite things about this hike is that you can camp on this hike so if you are going to be coming out this way you can have a campsite um, but you just have to pack it in pack it out and leave no trace behind now when you are camping you have to camp at least 100 feet from the streams lakes and trails and then also uh, camp stoves are recommended fires are prohibited at and above Timberline. So you have to keep that in mind uh, if you don't want to get in trouble. And also it's for the wildlife safety, your safety, and the safety of our beautiful wilderness out here. So you can get this information at fs.usda.gov. And just by looking up the Gore Creek Trail on Google yourself, um, that'll help to give you all of the information about this hike, what you'll see along the way, and what the rules and regulations are for if you are interested in doing any camping on this hike. So again, if you're going to be bringing it in, make sure you're bringing it out. Uh, don't leave any trace behind. But again, get all the information online. Uh, and this is a super cool spot to camp. I just uh, was, was telling some friends, I think that I found our spot for the weekend out here in the White River National Forest on the Gore Creek Trail. Thank you to Christy Sports for bringing us this weather today. If you're saying to yourself, I don't have any camping gear. I don't have any gear. Well, you can always go to Christie Sports. They're going to help you out. And Ashley is actually going to be chatting with them coming up next when we come back.